Hey, I'm Jake. I'm Amy Lynn. And this is Art Kitchen. Where we make art in our kitchen. But like literally I can see our kitchen sink like right past the camera. So no lie, this is in our kitchen. I'm a fashion photographer. And I'm a stylist. And we've been collaborating on editorials and making art for a few years yeah. now. Ever since the day we met. The Kismet. Day. Kismet mm -hmm. on a Kismet. shoot. Kismet. 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 When these kids met. So how it started was with me sort of sharing how I like to do fashion illustrations and fashion sketches. Some friends and I would like randomly pick three different things. Like literally I think one time it was like Tokyo Disco NASCAR. And then you have to create a fashion illustration based on that. So that sort of got us thinking. And we thought it would be like a cool way and a cool challenge to um, incorporate into making editorial images to kind of have to pull out words and incorporate those items or objects into the image that we're creating. In like what essentially I've been referring to as a fashion Mad Libs, we have like two different categories that we'll be drawing from. The first category of things is really just everyday objects, stuff that you could find anywhere throughout your house or easily at a CVS or a convenience store. Dollar Tree. Dollar whatever. Tree, whatever. Um, so like Q-tips, aluminum foil, plenty of other things. I'm not gonna list them all here. <laughs> the second category is really like visual cues or like thematic cues. So there might be Victorian or moody or, God, I hope we don't pull this one, but like neon, which would be a huge challenge for us. So we'll draw two things, one from each category for the shoot and have to figure out how to make them work together. We hope to essentially like document our creative process, sort of share like the brainstorming that we do and the conversations and ideas, good and bad that come out of that. Cause let me tell you right now, there will be some bad ideas. Yeah. Which is how we are to this point sitting in front of a camera and getting ready to bear our creative souls to all of you. Which is intimidating. For both of us. So this is our first art kitchen. First one. First art kitchen. Our model for this week is our friend Nicole. We're so excited. She's coming to Chicago from New York City to do the first art kitchen with us. All I'm right. Shake it. Yeah, you guys, this is our first poll oh we're doing. <sighs> Makes me nervous, but excited. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Crepe paper. Crepe paper. Like that crinkly color. Like you had at eighth grade dances <laughs> that you were like a little gay boy twisting two colors together and stringing them up, thinking you were making the most beautiful dance in the world. Was that you? Maybe. <laughs> and I'm so nervous. I don't want it to be weird. <laughs> <laughs> Interpretation. Yeah. That could be dark color, dark makeup, mood, all of the above. This is actually not the worst. I'm really excited. And honestly, I think Nicole will be like, these are perfect ones for Nicole. For her. Yeah. Like earlier we were talking <laughs> and we were thinking like something light and airy would be fun to yeah. do with Nicole, but I'm almost even more intrigued now that About it's dark. Like, like yeah. literal opposite. I see like one way of using the crepe paper is at like suspending it or hanging it just like down yeah. like get tons of different colors or like like or similar colors right it almost like vine like background or like yeah. a setting of some like, sort almost a prop in a way yeah. you could even like bring it into the hair makeup yeah. and stuff like maybe even tearing it up little yeah you know like an outline of something and it's like all dark but you see her i don't know like she was a crazy paper shot i loved how it like how we wrapped it around her it almost looked like a wig cap yes. like in yeah, a way yeah. and um or like the jaw for or like you know like she just yeah, got yeah. out of like a vintage dentist office yeah. like, <laughs> like skirt or like like light cray paper or something and like movement <gasps> oh my god what if we like made the bodice of a dress out of it by like gluing it to her so it's like, like one paper with her body. it almost yeah like just love that the idea of doing like navy dark yeah like for the vibe or even like the lighting or like the background, background. <laughs> Thank you. 
And just to do something with your best friend. That's kind of what we subscribe to. So yeah. we're going to make it. So subscribe of- to us. <laughs> <laughs>